Andy Mogul. It is leap year, you know. In Ireland, a woman can propose to a man on the 29th of February. Dad, I'm not going to Dublin. I'm going to propose to my boyfriend on leap day. Yeah? Yeah. So I thought, woo, woo. <laughs> That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> Can Amy Adams open a movie all by herself? Not according to Sunshine Cleaning, but this is January and the pickings are slim. Besides, she signed on to star in this film when she was hot off Enchanted and had yet to crash and burn and Miss Pettigrew lives for a day, Sunshine Cleaning and Doubt. However, Adams was delightful in two of this summer's hits, Night at the Museum 2 and Julie and Julia, and the critics still love her. In fact, who doesn't love Amy Adams? She's having the kind of career Reese Witherspoon would be having if she hadn't quit over the whole Ryan Phillippe thing. Reese, not every guy's a winner. Relax. In fact, look at who Amy Adams is starring opposite in this movie. The villain from Watchmen. I can hardly believe it's the same guy either. What an actor. Sure, we all know how this movie is going to end. But hey, it's in Ireland. That's different. Enough. It's January. And nominations for the Streamy Awards are now open. If you've already nominated Beyond the Trailer, thank you. If not, please go to these links and nominate us. You can vote once per day through January 22nd, and we've posted the links in the description for this video. So go vote now, and after the break, we'll find out what audiences think of Leap Year. Adams carry a movie. Oh yeah, she's pretty good. I definitely think so. I love yeah. her. I can't say ever, but did she carry this movie? I don't know. You were going in to see it for the second time. Yes. Since yesterday. Yes. Why do you love this movie so much? Amy Adams. I've always adored her. She is just so fantastic in whatever role that she is in. I like her. She's yeah. a great actor. Yes, yeah, she's a great actor. Oh, yeah. I thought she was so cute, but then again, she's always cute. I was texting my girlfriend the whole time. Oh, wow. It's just the most incredible movie ever. If you ever had a ever had a, like a hesitant thought about loving somebody and you wish you had told them or gone back to them, you need to see this movie. It's kind of trite but entertaining. What made you come and see it today? I was waiting for it ever since I saw the previews. Oh, so, so the trailers look good to you, yeah, right? Yeah, it's really good. The coming attractions which were, you know, picked all the hot spots. Oh no, the best parts are in the trailer? Yes. Everyone's seen this trailer. It's a romantic comedy. Mm -hmm. Are there any surprises in the movie? Not really. It's predictable. I hate to say that, but you know, it was good. It's, it's not predictable at all. As a matter of fact, I had the uh, rug pulled right out from under me at the end. How did Ireland look? Pretty. Ireland is beautiful. Is Ireland <gasps> romantic though? Oh, that yes. You've got the, the breeze. You've got the views. You've got the cliffs. Caribbean, Mexico, anywhere. You've got the beach. Big deal. Everyone's been to the beach. What do you think of Matthew Good? Was he a good romantic lead? Yes, he was. Oh, you seem a little hesitant. You know, he was, he was. <laughs> they just have this, this fire and connection because they're playing opposites, but yet they do connect on a deeper level. Ooh. You know that good and bad tension? Yeah. That brings the hotness out, right? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Right, right. I really would like to see a movie with both of them again, definitely. Oh, you would? What do you give it on a one to ten? Oh, five. I would give it at least about a nine. A nine and a half, eight. I would give it an eight. I really like this movie. I really, I'm going to give it a ten. Let's be honest. Aren't all romantic comedies basically the same? And it sounds like this one is pretty good as audiences give Leap Year an eight. And Beyond the Trailer is out here every week covering every major release. So be sure to subscribe so you never miss an episode. I'm Grace Randolph reporting from AMC Empire 25 and you've just gone Beyond the Trailer. Beyond the Trailer.